What's up guys, it's Shows here, and before I start the video, I wanted to say that I'm really sorry if you're not posting that often. Um, I'm going to make a commitment to try uploading at least two or three times every single week, and maybe even more than that. Today's topic is going to be kicked out of Kroger, or not necessarily kicked out of Kroger, we, uh, we got accused for stealing stuff from there. So, let's go ahead and get into the story. Alright, so me, my friend Brett, Ben, Zach, uh, I think I've mentioned some of them before, but we were all hanging out at his house, yeah, at his house, and uh, we decided to walk up to Kroger. We were messing around with like axe cans and fire and stuff, and so we, we were walking up to Kroger, having a good time, talking, messing around, hiding from cars and stuff, hiding from cops, because like curfew, you know, and we eventually got to Kroger. It took us about, I don't know, two hours, an hour, somewhere around there. Uh, we were gonna walk to Taco Bell after, but we decided that was too far away. So we went to Kroger and we bought uh, four axe cans and like two things of hand sanitizer. And if you didn't know, hand sanitizer is actually like really flammable and it's really fun to mess around with. It's so, like you can put it in your hand, light it on fire. It'll it'll hurt a little bit, but you gotta get over it. So what we did is we went to this Kroger and we bought four axe cans. I remember because we got one for each of us. So this lady was checking us out, uh, as in like in the aisles and stuff, and. Uh, she she let us have her stuff and I stole a couple lighters and I gave them to everyone so we can mess around And so we went across the street to this church kind of feel bad for it But I mean what can you do we couldn't really do it anywhere else and stupid us There's a there's a fire department right across the street like literally right behind the Kroger and That Kroger was on the other side of the street To I mean it was lucky of us that we didn't get caught by the fire department uh, but we were lighting stuff on fire, messing around with the axe, and throwing hand sanitizer everywhere, marking stuff on the ground with the axe, and lighting it on fire. Then, um, we, uh, we ran out of axe and hand sanitizer, so we went back in there to steal some, alright? And this is when it got bad. We, we went in there, and we stole, like, four, I think. And, so the lady, she's like, open your bag. And we're like, why? She goes, you stole stuff from us. And she's, we're like, um, no, we didn't. And she's like, or I have four or five boys, something like that. And she's like, I, I know what they do. And I'm like, um, we didn't do anything. And so uh, the security guards came and talked to us. And Brett, he he had the bag. And he was trying to dump all the stuff out. He threw, or he uh, he didn't throw them. He rolled them underneath the refrigerator. I think, I think that's what happened. Because I was trying to distract him. And, uh... After all that happened, uh, we had the axe bottles that we had before and bought. And she was the one who checked us out, and she, she was being an asshole. But we went across the street, or I went across the street, because she was saying that we didn't, we didn't like, buy those. So I had to go across the street, and I was afraid that we burned the receipt. Because we also got some, like, food and stuff, and we, uh, like, burned the box of Twinkies that we got. Uh, so I was looking around, I was kind of getting worried, and I was a little bit scared, because it was, like, 2 in the morning behind a church in the dark, uh, no lights whatsoever. And so eventually I found the receipt and I, I bolted back to the Kroger. I mean, like, I'm not about to be over there by myself. So we, I got back to the Kroger and uh, I remember Brett, he like bought two more Axe cans <laughs> just so, to make it look like we didn't uh, steal anything. And he didn't steal anything afterwards because he, he got too scared to like take it out or you know what I mean? Got too scared, and so, so we checked out. And I, I was like, uh, "Can you hurry it up?" And I was trying to be rude because she was being an asshole to us. She goes, "You don't have to be that rude to me." And uh, then I, I don't know what happened, but then we started talking about like uh, Ferguson or something like that. And Brett and her were having an argument, <laughs> and she goes, "That's why we vote." I, I was so confused, but after all. Uh, we were walking back towards Brett's house, and I'm pretty sure we went, no, maybe we went back to the church, I can't remember, but we went down this huge street, it, it was big, open, and uh, we got back to the street where we knew we could run, and we tried to light all the axe cans, every single one of them didn't pop except for like one, and Brett's fingers got burned, like uh, he got blisters and stuff, and he also got like some axe stuff down his throat, and I mean that sucks for him, like honestly. We lit some leaves on fire and eventually finally got it to pop and we ran. And uh, th there was a huge fire actually. Like, well, we thought there was a huge fire, but 
We didn't really realize that the grass was small and it couldn't really get lit on fire and it was wet. So uh, we got some newspapers, we lit on fire, axe bomb went off and so we ran. And we looked back and there was a lot of smoke. So we just ran and uh, later that night we just went to bed. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a like, comment, uh, anything that you may want me to put in my next video, go ahead and comment that. I'm, I'm going to be looking at all the comments. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. This has been Shows. Peace.